In the previous chapter, I discussed how CodeIgniter loosely implements the model view controller pattern, then demonstrated both a view and a controller. The final component, the model, traditionally contains application data, logic and business rules, and functions. CodeIgniter defines models as PHP classes that work with information in a database, which is pretty vague. Out of the box, they're treated just as a collection of properties, which I mentioned previously is similar to a domain object. These properties are named exactly the same as the database columns with a one-to-one -one relationship. CodeIgniter models contain no other standalone functionality by default. Traditionally, the model is a class where common functionality can be defined, including create, where something like a timestamp or other default values can be set, read, where a record is retrieved from the database and used to populate the model, update, where a record in the database is saved, and destroy, where the record in the database is deleted. Create, read, update, destroy is a common collection of functionality, referred to by the acronym CRUD. In this chapter, I'm going to extend the CodeIgniter model to define the database table and primary key that's associated with it. Then, I'll integrate CodeIgniter's database functionality with CRUD methods to allow models to save themselves, similar to traditional MVC. With this context, I'm going to create models that will allow me to represent back issues of a magazine.